why we observe eight precepts to develop our practice. Because if we are in the same level every day, you know, there is no progress. We want to progress with our practices. It is called gradual development. Is the teaching of the Buddha, we have to develop gradually. There is a sutra in Majjhimanikaya, it is called Ganaka Moggallana Sutra. Ganaka Moggallana Sutra. In this sutra, the Buddha mentioned how we should develop step by step. Okay. A Brahmin, a Brahmin asked question from the Buddha. His question was, you are here, you are Dhamma, you are preaching the Dhamma, as the Buddha you are here, and you are Dhamma also existing. You guide the people for the liberation. But some people liberate, some people cannot liberate. The fall with your Dhamma or with the person. Then the Buddha asked question from the Brahmin. Okay, someone come to you and ask, the way to the city of Rajagaha. Then you guide the person, you go straight, turn left, again go straight, turn right. In this manner, you tell him the path, the roads, how to go to the city of Rajagaha. Do you think the old people getting the information from you, they can reach to the city of Rajagha or not? Then the Brahmin replied to Buddha, Yes, recluse Gautama, some people know in the way, as I explain, they follow the way exactly and reach to the city of Rajagha. But some people, they don't follow the way exactly. Then they reach to some other places. They, <coughs> they sometimes miss the road the path and go to jungle, forest and they can't find the way. So then the Buddha said, in the same manner, I am here, I guide the people to liberate but only a few people, a few number of people follow the path as I guide it. Many people, they go different way and finally they cannot liberate. That is what happening. As Buddhist, we have to find the, the correct path correct path, as guided by the Buddha, not by that Bhante, this Bhante, that speaker, this speaker, that person who wrote that book, this person who wrote this book, no. That is the main mistake we are twin. We have masters, 
they are master than the Buddha. Right? We follow, yeah, they are religious leaders, I am a religious leader. But you can't follow my way. You must follow the way of the Buddha. The masters, religious leaders, speakers, all are the people who help you to find the path. They are help, they are supporting for you to find the path. The path should be exact and correct path guided by the Buddha. Mm. The way that discovered by the Buddha is not created by the Buddha. This is what mainly we have to understand to open our wisdom. To activate our right view. That is what the Buddha did not create any path for the liberation. The Buddha discovered the way how to liberate. It means the path, the truth remained in the world. The reality is not created by the Buddha. The universal reality remained in the world, but no one could discover it. The Buddha discovered. How discovered? The Buddha discovered through Insight wisdom. Insight wisdom also, the wisdom open within oneself. Okay, I cannot give you insight wisdom. Buddha also cannot give you insight wisdom. Don't ask for the wisdom from others. Wisdom itself is opening within you. Within you, within your mind. Then, to open the insight wisdom, we must know the way. Right? Without knowing way, the path, the, met the methods, we cannot open it. To open insight wisdom, we should train our mind to be mindful at this moment. When you train to practice mindfulness, stillness, then easily you can improve your insight wisdom. To practice mindfulness, attain to some stillness of your mind, you should, you must change your behaviors. The changing of your behaviors is called as sila. Achievement of stillness is called samadhi. Opening of insight wisdom is called panya. The path to liberation stand, stands on these three layers. Sila, samadhi, Panya. Sila Samadhi Panya. So, in Sangyutta Nikaya, the Buddha mentioned, Silang Vina Kuto Samadhi, Samadhi Vina Kuto Panya. Without Sila, it is very, very difficult to attain to mental cultivation. Without mental cultivation, it is very, very difficult to 
open insight wisdom. This is an starting point to open your insight wisdom that observing eight precepts and spending your time on this opposite day. <laughs>